Excuse me? Excuse me? Oh, okay, bye. Boo! I found you. Okay, bye. Oh, God. It's gotten worse. Oh, shit. Oh, the LCD screen's gotten worse. I just turned it on then and it's completely gone like black, like when it throws like the ink. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Marcy's down for his nap, so I'm making something to eat, a little bit of breakfast. Usually what can happen in the morning, not can happen, it usually does happen, is I'll just have, Marcy will wake up at about seven, we'll get up, I'll feed him, and I'll just have a coffee and just like a little snack of some sort. It's not really good, but just some banana bread or something to get me through, play with him. And then he'll go down for his nap at, it's at the moment it's 11.30, 12 for a couple of hours. And then I'll eat like a proper breakfast, like I'll have my wrap or something, which I guess isn't really... I guess that's more of a brunch, right? So, just regular wrap. But this has got a little bit of cheese in it. I felt like some cheese today. And I'll do, so it's just egg, cheese, and I'm just gonna do my salsa. And that will be it for the wrap. And I'm just making a coffee. <laughs> was a one dollar mug from Kmart. It's got the rose gold foiling on pink. So cute. Hubby sometimes uses it. So a little Woolworths order came this morning just of like baby essentials like nappies and stuff but this is I also got this banana bread which I keep showing you but honestly I, this banana bread is really, really good. I got cafe banana bread the other day and bought it home. Um, but this five slice from Woolworths is, um, it's got, it's got a lot of sugar per serve, but in all honesty, this, uh, toasts so nicely and it just feels lighter. You know, that banana bread that just feels like really heavy. And then I got some treats. I love fruit mince pies. That is the British in me. And my dad, every year, my father will like test a mince pie. So Mrs. Kippen is his favorite one. So I got a six pack of these. Hubby said, so what are you guys doing today? I said, oh, I'm just gonna shop for a new vlogging camera. And he was like, no, you are not. No. Damn it. I wonder what vlogging camera Tamara has. Her vlogging camera is epic. I would love to know what that is. It's so amazing and clear. Okay, let's do some Q&A <clears throat> on this janky camera. Hey, from Vlogtober. Oh my God, that's what I did on the vlog. Ah, uh, from Vlogmas day 14. Q&A first was Rosalia Davidson, hi babe. Mwah, she gave me kisses. Norma Lara, hi babe. She says she's fourth. No, you're second, babe. Third, Chanel Pole. Oh, you've been sick, honey, for three months. Shit. I hope you get better, babe. Thank God for your vlogs. Love from Sydney, the Hills District. Hey, shout out to the Hills. Taddy77, hi Tat. First, love your videos, Jerusha. Mwah. Alexa Starbook gives me love. Mwah. Hi, Alexa. Yes, I can't believe I'm first. I love you, Jerusha, all the way from California. Tasha Hartman. Hi, Tasha. Daniel. Hi, my Daniel, my gorgeous Daniel. Oh my gosh, he says out in the western suburbs on that day, it was 44 degrees Celsius. So this is Celsius, guys, not Fahrenheit. I don't even know in Fahrenheit. I'm going to say like 110. Oh shit, look at me converting over here. 110, 120 Fahrenheit. It's, look, 
needless to say. Sweating like a whore in a church. Skies delights. Hi babe rides. Bye Uncle Jeff. Loved him in your vlogs. Oh my gosh, yeah no. Jeff he was so great. He's just the most amazing uncle. He's always just been so involved in mine and Jarrah's lives and now Mussy's lives, which is so gorgeous. Gina Moore. Hi Gina writes. Hello from South Texas. I love your vlogs, babe. And I love Mussy. Oh. P.S. I just received my first walk from Fashion File. Eh, eh, nice girl, nice. Look, if the walk works for you, good on you. It is such a beautiful piece. It just didn't work for me, but good on you. Okay, this comment comes from Lee Ann. Hi, Lee. She says, my son is Duty. That's his name. Duty? I haven't heard anyone else say that name. Is that the name you keep saying? Duty. Um, I'm not saying duty. I, oh, I'm saying soupy. Do you hear me saying something like that? Soupy? I call Masi soupy sometimes as like an abbreviation of masupial because he used to be, we used to call him masupial when he was newborn because he would curl up like a little possum. So he was called masupial, then I just nicknamed him soupy. So maybe you're hearing that. Oh my god, Lee, your son's name's duty. That's so cute. Or duty, am I saying that right? Oh my god, how cute. Shout out to Erica. Erica Dimples about life. Hey Jerusha, love your vlogs. Always loving you. Big hugs and kisses. Hi Erica, I see you girl. Okay, last comment or question. This comes from Lynn. Hi Lynn Dowdell. Hey Jerusha, just wondering if you'd like to be 25 bandolier as an everyday bag. Listen, honey. Have you not been watching my channel? God, I love it for a life bag. That is my life bag. Have you tried the XL Reverse Monogram Strap on it yet? Now that's a good question. I haven't. I haven't. Although I have the XL Strap on its longest setting now and I don't know if it will be long enough. Maybe we can try it in this vlog. Ooh, I wanna show you something in this vlog below, guys. Thanks for the question, Lynn. I would definitely try it out. Good question. I want to show you something in this vlog as kind of like a feature because I get so many questions about this. And actually, Karis just mentioned this in her Louis Vuitton collection video, which I just got asked about. Zipper differences and tarnish differences and lock tarnish differences. So I'm going to show you something on my cosmetic cases. Okay, my is asleep still. So I have to do my ASMR voice. <laughs> but this is what I wanted to show you guys up close. So these zipper pulls are the pouches that I have here at the moment. And you can see that these are like what are the dull ones. So that is more of the dull zipper. And this Damieri bean is a shiny zipper. Again, this is the age-old question as to why, which a lot of us can't really answer. We do, we don't really know. Um, Karis is suggesting that maybe it's a price difference, but they're shiny on the Eva and then they're dull on the pochette accessoire, which really, I mean. It's not that big a price difference. So I'm probably gonna say maybe it just comes down to the factories and where, you know, all the different um, spare parts are or all of the accessory parts on the toiletry 26. Dull. And this is um, dull on the toiletry 19 and you can see it against the shininess of my Maltouch charm. So there's my Maltouch. So yeah, I just wanted to show you them all up close. So dull, 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 shiny. 
And I remember on my um, Montaigne MM, so shiny, like just out of this world shiny, like so beautiful. And all my speedies are dull, like that. Yeah, I just wanted to show you that, share that with you up close, all the hardware. Here you go, a present from Nana. Welcome to the paleo life. Oh, thank you. Do you like that rice cracker? Yummy. Quick, I think Nana's here. We'll show her how good that you are eating. Cracker, He's showing you his rice cracker. Can you take me to for a walk? Oh, you want to? You want a finger to it too? Show Nana the rice cracker. Oh wow! He's having a rice cracker. Hi, darling. Hi, darling. Oh. How's things? Hi, everybody. So hot out there. I've been to a very <coughs> Oh goodness! Been that before? <laughs> I never seen Ooh. that. Oh yeah. God, that's seriously the cutest thing ever. He just got up on his chair sat down to eat his lunch all on his own is that your new lunch tomatoes potato poppers and some sausage yum mushy is it nice do you know it Carla? okay one at a time one at a time too many no no one at a time eat one of these one at a time I see one at a time. Eat that. I've got my hand over the plum noisettes, the two oh. that he's left. Okay. Here you are. Oh, yeah. Bon appetit. Yummy. We're having lunch together. Yummy. Is Nana going to try hers? You can go around, Mussy. Mussy. Oh, Mum, help him. That's so mean. Mussy, you can go around. Hello, in there. <laughs> oh, my God. Oddest way to get the ball. Uh, Whoa. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are you a little gecko on my back? Just come back from the spa. Oh, it's all sparkly. Oh, oh, smells pretty. Okay. Oh no! Yeah, the new thing is the seat belts. I want to show you guys this. The sun is like actually setting. Mum picked this up for me as a present the other day at the markets. Um, and it's so cute. It's by a company called Friday, fridayschild.com.au and she does the markets. And she does like children's um, toys and clothes, I think. But this was one of the little books. And it came in this little bag. And it's apparently the story that's her little oh yeah this is her little um catalog look how cute these gift packs are you know people at markets really do beautiful beautiful things it's like etsy but in a market and it was <laughs> it's a story of coco chanel's actual life and it tell it starts from you know when she was a child and went to like was in the orphanage and everything and it tells it in like a storybook way. Isn't that just gorgeous? This is a story of a French girl called Gabrielle. When she was little, Gabrielle lived in an orphanage. 
And it goes through and tells the whole story in like a children's novel. I thought that was so gorgeous. I just wanted to share that with you. Mum bought that for me. Okay, guys, I will see you in tomorrow's vlog. Bye.